today you're gonna to be seeing me making my little tiny s'mores pie. Well, they're not, well, they're mini pies. Obviously, they're not huge giant pies. They're six points and they're mini s'mores pies. And what makes them special is the little tiny crunchy marshmallows that go on top. It's not super complicated. It's like, really, it's like two steps. It's, I don't need to be making a recipe video for it, but it's more like me just wanting to share it on YouTube for people to be like, what is that little pie? That's really easy and only six points and really delicious. I'm just using this video as a way to kind of let more people know about this fun little idea because when I first started Weight Watchers, I went on YouTube and I looked for all kinds of recipes. So stay tuned. It's going to be quick, but it's going to be yummy. Okay guys, so this is everything you're gonna need for this recipe. You're gonna need the Keebler Mini Ready Crusts. You're gonna need sugar-free chocolate jello. You're gonna need the Kraft Jet Puffed Mallow Bits. I only had three of the mini crusts left, so that's what I'm making today. Also, my grocery store only had the sugar-free chocolate and vanilla swirl pudding left. They didn't have any regular chocolate ones. So that's what we're going today too. So I just have to mix this up to get that vanilla all mixed in there. These sugar-free jello pudding cups are two points per cup. So I'm only gonna put half into the pie crust, making it one point worth of pudding. I'm just eyeballing half of the cup here. It's not an exact science, but once you're filling up both pie crusts, you're gonna be able to see if it's even or not, so it's pretty easy to fix. Even without the marshmallows, that already looks so good. Now for the crunchy little marshmallows. Now these little marshmallows are like Lucky Charms marshmallows, guys. They're like crunchy and yummy and they just make this pie like everything. I definitely recommend waiting to put the marshmallows on until you're gonna serve it. Like if you make these ahead of time, definitely just do the pie crust and the pudding don't do the marshmallows until you're about to hand it to the person because the crunchy marshmallows are important. For some reason, the texture of the crunchy marshmallow and the pudding in the crust is kind of what makes these pies so amazing. And I'm pretty sure something, yep, yep, mm, I remember now. <laughs> this is real life, okay, you guys? I'll just give that one to my husband. <laughs> okay, well, here's one pretty one. Oh, look how cute. It's so cute and it's so yummy. It's so freaking easy, you guys. Okay, yeah, that one, that one's not gonna go on the Instagram. Mm -mm. Look at this little s'mores pie. I cannot with this. Why are miniature things just so, so cute? <laughs> you guys, those pie crusts are four points each. Like you could do so much with these pie crusts. Make some pies. Share them on Instagram and tag me. I want to see your yummy pies. These things are so good and they're only six points for the whole pie. So, hello, yes. And like I said, it's super simple to make these, so it's not that long of a video, but I just wanted to pass on this idea to all of you out there in YouTube land. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Make sure that you like this video and subscribe and follow me on Instagram. That's where it all goes down. It all goes down in the Instagram. Thanks for watching.